at Stoke-on-Trent, these youngsters at a comprehensive school are working on models for a forthcoming art exhibition. Open to all school children up and down the country, it's a competition with a difference, but the material they're working with is a plaster normally used in the home by do-it-yourself fans. For the young sculptors accustomed to using wood or stone, this plaster filler is a completely new art material. These girls in a London school use a slightly different technique. Wire frames are bound with cloth, which has been dipped in the filler. 80 of the 800 exhibits submitted will be entered in a school's art competition in London. Judges here are Henry Pluckrose, Hubert Dalwood and Susan Stranks. They're examining the bull, made of scrap metal and plaster filler based on a wire framework. Christ the Healer was made at a school in Devon. Here again, the dipped cloth method was used. The very high standard reached by the children made the task all the harder for the judges. The overall winner, White Queen, comes from the Sale Grammar School in Cheshire. Actress Wendy Craig unfortunately had her wrist encased in quite another kind of plaster. From Warwickshire, The Ship by Richard Taylor was the winner in the 8 to 10 group. From Staffordshire by Trevor Palmer, The Bull was the winner in the 14 to 15 age group. Hubert Dalwood, principal of the sculpture department at Hornsey College of Art, presents the prizes. The winning entry, White Queen, a rather oversized chess piece, was made entirely of egg boxes, paper cups and scrap paper mixed into shape with the pasta. The models can be seen in an exhibition which will shortly tour Great Britain.